on a foggy morning in October 2001. A Cessna citation strays onto the active runway at Milan Lenate Airport, Italy. The citation is hit by an MD-87 that's been cleared for takeoff. 118 people die. Cranbrook, British Columbia, February 1978. A 737 attempts a late go-around to avoid a snowplow on the runway and crashes. 42 people die. March 1977. Two 747s collide on a runway in Tenerife, the Canary Islands. 583 passengers and crew die, making this runway incursion the worst accident in aviation history. Disaster is as close on the ground as it is in the air. A runway incursion is any occurrence involving the unauthorized or unplanned presence of an aircraft, vehicle, or person on the protected area of a surface designated for aircraft landings or departures. Runway incursions are a very real danger, and they're occurring with increased frequency at aerodromes across Canada. This program uses examples from real life situations to demonstrate some of the common errors that can lead to runway incursions. And it shows what steps you can take to avoid a runway incursion. An airport can be a confusing place, especially at night or in poor visibility. The pilot of the Cessna is unfamiliar with the airport layout and visibility is poor. He didn't learn the airport layout during his pre-flight preparations and now he's trying to follow a chart while taxiing. He's not watching where he's going and he's taxiing too fast for the conditions. Cessna 155, runway 32, taxi via Golf, left on Bravo, hold short, runway 07. Um, 32. Golf, Bravo, hold short at 07, Cessna 155. Ground control has instructed him to taxi for runway 32. This involves crossing runway 07. He's been told to hold short. North Air 72, wind 050 at 8, clear to land, runway 07. Roger, North Air 72. North Air 72 is cleared to land on runway 07. Unsure of his position, the Cessna pilot doesn't realize he's about to cross an active runway. Distracted and uncertain of his position, this pilot almost taxis into the path of a landing aircraft. One four winds calm altimeter to niner niner three. Roger Transair two seven five. We are two miles on final for one four. It's not only aircraft that can wander onto an active runway. A truck two zero leaving garage for Air Eastern hangar. Truck two zero proceed via Bravo Charlie Echo. Hold short of runway one four. Traffic on final. Um, Roger. Bravo, uh, Echo Charlie, hold short of one four. Truck two zero. Truck two zero, that's Charlie Echo. Roger. The driver of this truck doesn't understand the directions he's been given by the flight service specialist. He thinks he'll annoy him by asking for clarification. The flight service specialist hears the uncertainty in the driver's messages but he assumes the driver is fully aware he's approaching the active runway and that there is an aircraft on final. Preoccupied with finding his way, the vehicle operator rolls through the hold line at runway 14. Truck 2-0, get off the runway, now!
This time, the flight service specialist noticed the truck approaching the runway. But it could be a different story at night or in poor visibility. Express 3525, taxi to position, runway 6 left. To position 6 left, Express 3525. Citation Bravo 77, contact tower on 118.9, good day. Tower on 118.9 for Citation Bravo 77, good day. The Citation crew is behind schedule and in a hurry to take off. Because of this, they've misheard their taxi instructions. Instead of taxiing to the end of 6 left, they believe they're to cross 6 left and proceed to 6 right. They're approaching a midpoint intersection and are about to enter the active runway. The tower controller has landing traffic and wants to expedite Express 3525's takeoff. 10 Air 79er, continue number one for runway 6 left. Traffic on the roll. Express 3525, wind 070 at 6, cleared for takeoff, runway 6 left. Clear for takeoff, runway 6 left. Express 3525. Tower citation Bravo 77 with you on taxiway Delta for 6 right. Citation Bravo 77, say again your position. Is this citation on Delta or Charlie? He's on Delta at 6 left. Citation Bravo 77, stop. Hold your position. Hey Tower, we just missed a small jet on 6 left. Tanner 79er, pull up and go around. Traffic on the runway. Citation Bravo 77, exit runway 6 left immediately. Fortunately, Express 3525 is able to lift off and clear the citation. Had it not, history has taught us that the outcome could have been deadly. Distractions, uncertainty, poor visibility, miscommunication, and working under pressure. These are the conditions that can set the stage for a runway incursion. Prevention is everyone's responsibility. Pilots, air traffic controllers, flight service specialists, and vehicle operators should use common sense and follow some basic safety procedures. Avoid distractions in the cockpit while taxiing, like running through checklists or engaging in unnecessary conversation. Remember, a safe flight is from gate to gate. Be particularly vigilant at night or in poor visibility. Look out for other traffic and watch carefully for airport signage. Become familiar with airport layout and taxiway designations. Make this a part of your pre-flight preparations. Report faded or missing signage and markings to ground control. Listen carefully for instructions over the radio and read back all hold short instructions. Avoid ambiguous communications and make sure the person you're speaking to understands what you've said. Don't be afraid to ask for help or a repeat if you're not sure. Delays happen. Be patient and keep a cool head. If you think a pilot or vehicle operator is lost or unsure of their position, offer assistance. And always be courteous and professional in your communications. Runway incursions happen when you're distracted, when you're stressed, or when you're unsure of what you're doing. Almost always, the direct cause of a runway incursion is miscommunication. So whether your job is on the ground, in the tower, in a flight service station, or in the air, use clear and proper terminology, listen carefully, and always remain courteous. Let's work together to make Canadian aerodromes safe and efficient places to operate. Because runway incursions are real.